decent time come on bright skin is on smooth look at that i mean i got this pimple right here but it's fine it's going away skin is on smooth i did my whole skincare routine and completely forgot to take a shower <laughs> so i had to go and take a shower thankfully it just like takes off the stuff on my neck you know you have like some water spots pop up on your chin and stuff but it just takes off let me turn this down a little bit because you own brizite uh -oh. there you go. Okay. but yeah it's hate like you know the water like splashes up like at the bottom of your chin or whatever but i don't get it all on my face um so completely forgot to take my shower but took my shower and i just just applied no lotion to my neck <laughs> freaking forgot to do all of that i'm like i'm not gonna go through all that again yeah so today is saturday that i'm filming this it may be a Saturday or Wednesday when you're watching it. I'm not sure. Um, I'm finally back on track with the uploads because I like just, anyways, I'm back on track. But yeah, girl, today is a going to be hopefully a productive day. I picture it being that as, at least. God bless to say the same. I had to get some extra groceries. So this is my last weekend as a 30 year old woman. <laughs> I cannot believe well I can believe thank you Jesus for blessing me to see another year I'll be 31 come Monday March 15th is my birthday I'm filming this on the 13th um girl I don't have no plans you like you know last year we had the birthday vlog I went out and did a little spa day we went and um I went and like a little shopping or whatever went to Target um my family sung me the happy birthday song that all of you guys like which is just our tradition really love singing that birthday song for just anybody's birthday but this this year COVID got your girl on sit down like I'm not and it's not just because like COVID I'm scared or anything like that it's just I am tired all I want to do is wake up watch tv eat and watch more tv and that's it that's all i want to do <laughs> that's all i want to do me and my mom may go out to eat somewhere um but i'm like i don't have to have a gift like pay for my food like all i want is food that's all i want is food that's what is so sad but that's all i want is food and rest um so yeah that's what we're doing really that's what i'm doing on monday i took friday and friday and monday off and my cousins candy and jaleesa and mama are going to come over tonight and we are all going to chill um we're going to go eat a couple places that i want to eat on sunday since that's the only day i actually have to spend with other people for my birthday rather yeah we're gonna go spend some time just like out in this like kind of galleria area just like eating and, and all that and looking at the houses over in river oaks because you know i love real estate 
love real estate um but looking at the house the river oaks and houses and just kind of spending the day out and then coming back and eating later on that's all i plan on doing for my birthday but yeah so this is just me prepping for that i actually have a nail technician coming over at 11 which is about a little less than an hour um 54 minutes uh he should be here he's gonna be doing my nails and my feet um, this is a complimentary service from this service called Cherry. It's a mobile um, nail technician, you like, like a mobile nail salon. Um, the people that I actually use, which is Reward Style, actually the company that I use, Reward Style, uh, I think the lady that created that, she created this mobile nail salon. So I'm gonna see how it goes. It's finally in Houston. And they emailed me for a complimentary, um, you know, service. So I'm like, big birthday weekend. So I just want my nails done without having to pay for it. That's a beautiful thing. So hopefully it goes well. Yeah, got a little grocery, um, got some groceries from, I guess I could have showed y'all. Got some groceries from H-E-B. And I actually need to, come on now. <clears throat> Hello. I actually need to um, put these groceries up. <laughs> Y'all saw me put these, I think I got about an hour ago, these groceries came. Um, everything is like mostly, most of the stuff that is cold is either, it's frozen. I already put the chicken up, like I got some chicken. My original um, fast food budget for months, for the months were like 250 because I just eat out all the time. But I think I'm gonna lessen that to 100 and cook more um because i want to learn how to cook y'all i read ecclesiastes the whole book has changed a girl's thought process on life like if you're a person that goes goals to go 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 like you're you're constantly goal oriented and you have a hard time sitting down and enjoying yourself read ecclesiastes if you are not happy about your life in the moment and the things that are going on read ecclesiastes honey it really helped me it really helped me just be like you know what i prayed for everything that i have today i prayed for whether it feels and looks the way that i expected it to i pray for it and let me revel in that let me enjoy that let me continue to thank god for that and just live that in thankfulness and the goals they're still there and i will still work on them and guess what they're not going to take all of my what time and energy like i got other things that I would love to do, I'd love to get more in shape. I'd love to lose a bit more weight. I'd love to learn how to cook, cook. Like I wanted to have like a soul food, soul food house. Like I'm really domestic at heart, but I do not allow myself to do that. Cause sometimes girl, I, it's, it's, I don't allow myself that time to really nurture that part of me, the domestication um, of cooking. And I ain't a cleaning type person, but I want it to be clean. I wouldn't mind cleaning on a regular basis, like the regular stuff, but all that deep cleaning, that's not, that's not me. So I'm not domestic in that case, <laughs> but I'm domestic like, and I want to have people over, you know, have like entertain. I want to learn how to cook, 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 cook. Like, you know, the cooks that know, like, girl, your stuff is so good. Like everything they cook is good, but they don't act like it. I want to be that girl. <laughs> I want to be that girl like, oh, I can cook. <laughs> thank you, girl. I mean, I it needed a little seasoning. No, it's perfect. No, I mean, okay, thank you. I want to be that girl. <laughs> but um, yeah, there's so many other things that I want to work on, like my appearance, my, my uh, organization in my home. Girl, so much. And I thank God for blessing me to be on this different journey. I thank him for my job, all of that. But it's so much more to life. Um, so I'm kind of like kind of tired of talking about it all the time, you know? So that doesn't mean I'm not going to update you guys as the debt-free journey goes. As of now, I have $16,000 left to pay on my car. That is going to get done lickety, lickety, lickety split. Um, <laughs> uh, but yes, I have that left. And then we'll be moving on to these student loans. But I need to come through with this quick $10,000 dollars that i need to get taken off of these student loans because your girl don't want to pay it so that's gonna really help me i don't know about y'all but that's gonna bless my heart hopefully he comes through with that like this year like the end of the year maybe that's a good christmas gift <gasps> let's write them oh my goodness okay but anyways let me go ahead and put these groceries up uh i was gonna show y'all what i got but i guess i got time let me show you 
so I got some Banza pasta. I always get this. It's like chickpea pasta. Um, so if you're kind of want to, oh, come on now. You kind of want to be low on the kids arbs. This is some good, this is a good brand to use. So I got that and I'm going to try their plant-based uh chickpea pasta mac and cheese so we should see how they go um what else i eat i got two of these the impossible meat this is the only meat that i have tried from the grocery store that tastes exactly like ground beef you don't feel like you're missing none um so i got a couple of those I got my baby florets uh broccoli florets and then i got a couple of the Central Market Olive Oil, Virgin Olive Oil, because I just love the way it looks and I like to use it. I got some parsley because um, I found, well, I was running out, that's why. And I, thank you. So the parsley I got because I was running out and I found this really good garlic and parsley chicken recipe on Pinterest that I want to try like next weekend or so. Um, so I got some chicken thighs and chicken breasts that I already put up. I got a couple of, uh, Roman tomato. Is it Roman? Raymond? Roman? Roman tomatoes. I think it's Roman tomatoes and some avocado. And then I got some sliced squash because I forgot all about other vegetables. Like all I really eat is spinach, broccoli, carrots, cauliflower. That's it. <laughs> I forgot all about the other vegetables. So I like squash. So try squash. Got a couple bags of those. Got some uh, stir fry medley, uh, broccoli blend for stir fry, the HEB brand. And then got some of that I can't believe. Uh, some sticks because I plan on making a cake or some brownies or something. Um, they get, oh God, y'all, is this child tofu? Oh, Lord. I've never tried this cheese. This is not the cheese that I selected. I'm sure they substituted. I hate when that happens. But, um, we'll see. I feel like something missing. I need to go through my, um, order thing. Oh, and some tissue. Because it's about to be some extra booties in the house. So, I need some extra tissue. But, I need to go through my order and see what may be missing. Because I feel like something is missing. And I'm about, I'm hungry. So I'm about to turn on 7th Heaven because I'm keeping, keeping my TV for the next couple of days on the not ratchet. Like I love watching all kinds of like Real Housewives of Atlanta or just other sh like stuff that is not stressful, but more action packed, kind of get your heart like, you know, like, you know, not, <laughs> not like that, but interesting. Um, and I'm not saying Seventh Heaven isn't interesting, but it was one of my shows that I watched all the time when I was young, young. I would record them, watch episodes over and over and over and over. Like your kids that, girl, I'm, I was that until like 15, 16. I was watching stuff over and over and over and over and over. The, I know my mom was like, girl. The episode, like, you know what's going to happen. Why? You can literally watch the episode in your mind from beginning to finish. Why are we watching this? But I don't know what it is. I just, I'm still like that to this day. But, um, so celebrate that in your children. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so I'm going to turn that on. Make me some. <gasps> That's what's missing. My eggs. Oh, no. Oh, man. It sucks. I got some just eggs from HEB and it's missing. Ugh. So they started delivering. They, I don't know if they started, but they've been delivering. And I've been seeing that more that stuff is missing from my delivery when it's when I get a delivery. Whenever I would go to the store, I would rarely have anything missing. Uh, like even doing curbside. But now that when I get stuff delivered, it's missing. Ugh. Okay. Now I got it. Now I don't know what to have for breakfast because I was going to eat that for breakfast and some spinach and some potatoes. <sighs> Let me get my mood right and I'll come back.
y'all i just finished editing a whole video that i was not expecting to finish editing but your girl is so productive today oh i'm just happy about it i was not expecting to finish editing that whole video so now i'm set up for like two more uploads that will already be ready before my birthday hits ah! so excited i remember that i have some packages from eloquy that they sent me and I wanted to try a couple things on with y'all. I think it's about four or five items that they sent me that I need to check out. Ooh, y'all close. <laughs> that I need to check out. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna try some of these on with y'all. And I'll have them linked in the description below. I like Eloquy. They have a ton of stuff. And they also have a, a lot of nice plus size um, swimsuits, y'all. I actually did a graphic of the plus size swimsuits. Hopefully I remember, I will try to link that graphic to, it's to the, it's linked on the Like to Know app, but all of the swimsuits that are on that graphic are from Eloquy and they're so cute, so cute. Eloquy sizing is by far my favorite when it comes to like swimsuits and so many other things uh, plus size. So let me try these on, maybe, ooh, y'all be close. I'll be close. Sorry, I'm, so, I'm always so close to the camera, I don't even realize it. Let me try these on and see how I can style them and maybe shoot them sometime soon. I don't know, let's see. So here is a classic black laser, laser, blazer. It actually looks like, it's like a long line blazer. It's It comes with long sleeves, but I have it tucked. Y'all forgive my room, it is not perfect girl, suitcase, all that. Um, <laughs> so it comes with uh, long sleeves, but I have kind of rolled them up a little bit. And I'll probably roll up again just so it doesn't fall because I like like more of the this kind of look. But yeah, it doesn't have a button here, but it has a hook, if that makes sense. So I like this long blazer. I'd style this with some jeans. And some nice heels or even tennis shoes, actually. Jeans in like a bodysuit, a black bodysuit or white bodysuit. Light colored jeans and some running shoes if you want to do a casual. And let me show you guys it undone. Really cute. Okay. <laughs> that was so ghetto. But yes, love this. It, actually, it has shoulder pads, y'all. This is in a 20. Hold on, can you see? This is in a 22. Bring the brightness up a bit. I guess I could have styled this for you guys, but like you get the gift. Um, yeah, like if you want to do an all black look, I could have done this, like tucked it with my uh Nike or Adidas running shoes and made like a cute little casual look. This is cute. Oh, I like this blazer. And I need more blazers. Like, I like that it's long, so it hides the booty. Um, I like that. And it may... Oh, no. There's no split in the back. It, I don't know if you can tell. I haven't had it run right. Yeah, there's no split in the back. It's just solid in the back. The back. But this is cute. Here is, like, the tannish nudish. I get this to act right. Yeah, the tannish nudish nude ish um <laughs> blazer i have it buttoned all the way up so this one is totally different because it comes with buttons and it is still i say totally different but it is a different blazer it is still uh long so it has the booty and let me unbuckle it unbutton it so you guys can see what it looks like open i like it let me turn down the brightness i'm loving the length of these blazers so yeah here's what it looks like this one this too has shoulder pads and like i said i like to roll my sleeves up you know what i'm saying because this came long sleeve just like imagine jeans like i'm chilling like my hand in my pocket jeans with some something on i don't know but <laughs> cute blazer and i'm like five six for height reference so this comes mid thigh on me so if you're a little taller, it's going to be a little shorter on you. And I thought I wasn't going to be a, a, a fan of these little shoulder pad vibes, but they're not bad. They are not bad. So here is that blazer. So this little ditty is a little different. Um, I don't know if you can tell, but it has one shoulder out like completely here. 
and then it comes with a tie like there's no um what do they call it like those loops there's no loop for the tie but this is actually leather or pleather rather i don't know because if it was leather i think it would be way more expensive than it was but um <laughs> it's actually pleather filling um i wasn't quite sure how to do this i didn't look on the picture um, I looked at the picture and saw it and I was like, oh, this is cute. I got to get it. But I hadn't looked on the picture and see how she styled this little, this little string bitty. Um, so I just tied it around. You could probably tie it around the back or I tried to do it in the side, but I don't like how long it was on the side. It just didn't look like it went properly, but yeah. And it's actually kind of lined a little bit. So it's a little thick. Um, but I like it. It's really different and cute. I can see... I'm trying to think what would I wear this with I'm always trying to pair something with jeans like jeans go with everything but I can see this with some black le leggings and nice little booties on a nice breezy uh spring day date night outfit ooh for the hubby yeah I mean I'm not married but I'm saying for y'all that are <laughs> but yeah for like when y'all go out on a date night or something like that this um, some black leggings and some black booties and a nice little clutch or jeans and some just like like uh the strappy heels you know that go around the ankle and then around the toe yeah that'd be cute um yeah this is cute outfit and it it's easy to put on because it just like buckles up here it's like a clamp in the back and yeah so that was easy to put on but this is cute. 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 So, yeah, this is, I think it's called the leather top. But I don't think it's real leather. I don't want them to lie. So, I don't think it's real leather. Um, but, yeah, cute, cute, cute. I think that would be a cute outfit. Oh, it makes me want to go on a date. Girl, I ain't got nobody. That's fine. That's fine. Y'all, she cute. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. Got the slits on each side. Uh, I love this. So comfortable, not bulky, and it lays just right so that it can kind of hide or conceal a little bit. Like nothing a little fashion tape can't handle right there. Conceal my bra strap, and I can still wear a regular bra. It does come a little low in the back here. Wait, let me see where it is. Right here and that's my bra so it comes a little low but i can always like hide it with some fashion tape oh so cute so cute and i i, I don't even have a lot of shape around with this this is just the normal uh my normal ashley stewart shapewear and oh, girl one of these days i will hold the camera still even with the tripod um and it's like very it's like ribbed fabric it feels good it's not heavy and it's it's got a, almost like a sweater feel but not because it's thinner i like this this is my favorite this dress makes me feel sexy i don't know why i'm <laughs> so extra um but yeah it is so cute i love the link comes down to the kizav but not too um not too far and I love the fact that it has slits. Y'all know, to me, slits gives extra femininity to any outfit. So, really, really like it. Oh my goodness, this is cute. Paired with a belt if I wanted to, but I probably won't because these titties are just sitting very low at the moment. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe I need a new bra. But I really like this. So cute. Really, really like this. And it feels so good and comfortable. It really feels good. I can go to sleep in this. It feels very comfortable. Eloquy with the wind. Thanks, guys. Oh, and this was a gift, by the way. They send me these items as gifts. So I'm just trying them on. But they feel like this dress feels so good. Oh, and y'all know black is like my favorite color to wear. Love wearing black. And not just because I'm a big girl and it slims you. But I just like the color on anybody it just looks so good but girl let me get out of this and go to the last item so you can see what the last item looks like and maybe i can catch a nap <laughs> this is the last item got the cute flamingo color i'm not sure how i feel about these it's like it's not tight actually it's like a scuba dress because it fits 
it's just fitted but you know how i don't like to accentuate the belly but it's not horrible it's very loud on camera it's like extremely loud on camera hold on maybe if i turn the bright and it's down yeah it's very loud on camera but um yeah it's not extremely hor it's not horrible i just probably would not really wear it. let me close the blinds yeah because you're getting like a random glare on it but yeah i probably wouldn't wear this just because this the rest of the dress is fine i just prefer not to be hugged right here it's actually not a bad dress like now i'm not sucking in Ugh, now i'm sucking in <laughs> but <laughs> yeah i prefer not but it is a cute dress i think if i did do this i would size up but the thing is like if I size up, it's going to be too big at the knees and I would have to get it taken in because it's kind of already kind of wide at the knees. I would have liked it to hug my silhouette more than my stomach, if that makes sense. But, you know, still working on this. But yeah, this is the dress. This is what it looks like on scuba. I like the sleeves. That's very cute. But my favorite is the other dress to be on the cool, on the real, on the honest. The other dress is more of my fave. It's a scoop neck. And it was kind of hard to like zip because the zipper, especially by myself, the zipper is a little low. And I, I needed help with this to get it on. So if you married, do your thug fizzle. Um, yeah. But I have an apple shape. So my belly is bigger than my silhouette now. The more I lose weight, the more hourglass it will become um if i start like wrapping this and stuff and doing more cardio it'll become that but i haven't gotten into the gym yet do not rush me i'm not rushing myself so it's more red it's coming off orange in this in this camera but it actually is more red uh, a little bit like an orangish red burnt orange rather but yeah it's kind of it's cute it's just not cute on me but it is a cute dress i just don't like it on me that black one though dc Y'all, my guests are starting to make it here. But I wanted to show y'all. First of all, listen. Oh, Damn. What? Oh. Come on, booty. I wanted to show y'all this sky real quick. It's so pretty. Oh, it is not showing up the best on camera, but look. It is dope. Let me see the twisted roll. It ain't got nothing to do with this sunset, so. Oh. Kinda, it's not, it's not showing like, yeah. It's so pretty. This guy's so flizzy. Anyway. Then I couldn't show y'all the whole overall scope of the sky because you mess around and get my address and I don't need that drama. Don't mess you. around. Yeah, mess around. Rich around. Rich around. Is it coming up on there? Kinda. Ooh, I kind of wanted to do it. Let me try on this here. Let's see if I can get a, a nice little boomerang at least. Oh, my hair look like I ain't just. You gotta buy that scooter though. It look like what? Real and it's oh, silent too. Ain't got no motor. Like <laughs> 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 what? You should have to not have a motor if you uh. Girl, you scared me. I sprayed out here uh for spiders. Oh. We're not gonna have it. We're not gonna have that drum. Oh, how you zoom? I thought you can zoom in like doing something like this. Hold these, hold the phone. Oh, thank you. Oh, I have to wipe off the bed. <laughs> oh, y'all on my kitchen, my bed. Okay. That's not a boomerang. That is a boomerang. Oh, what you do? I'm gonna slow it down. I'm gonna chop and screw it up. God Can is good. good. Dang. Okay. <laughs> I need to take that to work. Okay. Save all sorts of things. Okay. <laughs> oh, guys, it feels good out here. Leslie Poole, you don't want to eat right here? You don't want to eat right here? I'm done eating. Oh. I had to hurry up and eat. Got your titties out. What? 
No, it's not. Yeah. Yes, I got braids. I know. I was like, just when I took yours down, you put some. You sure did take yours down. I was like, I what's different? Week. Yeah. Oh my gosh, Liz. What did you? Uh, your sister. My sister. Yeah. Or my niece. No, nah, your sister. Cause she had uh, Sakaya had um, my bad. Y'all be track out. practice or track? Whatever. Yeah, let me set them up so they can chill while we chill. Yeah, she had to go. Ooh, she had to go to uh, a track meet. I don't think she had practice though. Oh, I spray so we should be safe. Ooh, can you flip that screen all the way up so I can see myself? Huh? Don't do nothing for my hair. Is your mic on? Yeah, but I can, uh, I can. Ugh, thank you. I can. When I edit it, I can, uh, change it a little bit, you know what I'm saying? I can. What you finna tell me? Speak louder than words, yeah, that's a lesson that I learned all by myself Let her know, I gotta let her know That she my white horse, she my medical She like my baby mama, know how to take care of me Get my baby problems, you gon' regret everything So I let her know, gotta let her know Came through the front door, I'll be ready for And if it's what you want, I'ma give it to you Yeah, promise, I'ma give it to you Stress is all around us, these high ceilings And I need a baby Pressure and make diamonds, I won't steal a baby Silent baby, hurts to see you crying Know you trying, they don't mind I ain't even have to curse Just because I ain't got fear it doesn't mean I'm scared Woo! We on the way to, uh, ooh this looks so fuzzy We're on the way to I like how like you got an orange background in. Instead of red That's thug Stop, Ashley. <laughs> you s oh, okay. <laughs> We're headed to Starbucks. So, yeah. The lighting is horrible in here, so I'm gonna go ahead and turn it off. Thanks. This vlog because we have been sitting up watching. Did I drop some? No. Oh, we've been sitting up watching Blended. Yes, Blended, and just enjoying our night. And I almost forgot to end the vlog. So. <laughs> you made it out the restroom. Mama has a bad habit of whenever she gets tired, she just dismisses herself quietly or she'll give an excuse and it should be gone for a whole hour of sleep so when she said she needs to go use the restroom i stopped the movie to make sure that uh she come back but i'm gonna end this vlog guys thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed it don't forget to like comment and subscribe because i am trying to get my numbers up so i will see you guys again on the next upload day bye bye oh that's cute <laughs>